As you may have seen my other videos, I was demonstrating the parts that come with the package for the endoscope camera that is used a lot by plumbers, electricians, automotive techs, people trying to find something wrong inside a car or something. Now I'm going to show you what you guys can do for a battery mod. Basically, if you want your device not to use batteries and maybe a DC source, well, here's the thing. In the battery compartment that this brings, it brings, well, it does not bring batteries, but you got to buy the batteries. Basically, they tell you to use normal batteries. Normal batteries come in 1.5 volts, right? 1.5 volt batteries are different than rechargeable batteries. Rechargeable batteries bring 1.25 volts. But basically all these batteries right here are in series. This comes with the power. This adapter thing, a handheld device, basically that powers your camera. This plastic device, like the battery holder comes with it. But the batteries don't. So basically if you don't have any batteries and you're in a place then you might have a wall outlet and you might want to use that. It'll be very useful if you can make your device, you know, wall powered uh, with with a DC. So all these batteries here are in your series. So 1.5, 1.5, 1.5, 1.5, 6 volts. So basically, you wanna might want to have a DC uh, adapter, wall adapter that's rated for 6 volts and at least 1 amp. Basically, like this one right here. This one is a 6 volt. 1 amp max power adapter. The tip inside is plus and the outside is minus. And basically, this is a 2.1 millimeter by I guess like 5 millimeters, maybe. Basically, it will bring 2.1. It does not matter. You just got to make sure that the parts you buy match the adapter. The adapter is the most important thing. Now, this little battery holder that I have aside, I found it somewhere in my stash. Basically, the mod that I'm thinking you could do, you will need a couple of parts. A new battery holder has to be four, similar to this one, similar sizes that I found. You probably find that, I don't know, maybe Radio Shack or some other store. And basically, it has to have, this is the original one, it has to have something like this. Well, the plus, the minus, which it does right over here. So basically, all the parts you need is a battery holder, a DC jack. So basically, that's where you want to put your plug in. You put your plug in there, and you could screw it on. This, you could you put it onto like a little plate. You could screw it on there. So basically, this is one of the most important parts. What else do you need? And I think that's basically it. Maybe you want to make one of these out of plexiglass. I'll probably show you a final vid when I do everything. Make something similar to this, or maybe you can modify this, make a little hole. So then your little jack, when you connect it to your battery holder, it'll probably come out. Not attached to this, but attached to your battery holder. So basically what I'm saying is, this part is going to go down into the device. And basically you're going to mount this on here. And basically when you put this inside, when you put the cap on, you might want to have a little hole in there. And then with this... You could just plug it in there and you have your device wall powered. So basically, as you can see in here, this this extra battery holder that I have will go in a special way in here. I think I got to modify it a little bit to fit. Uh, it will happen is that in here it has some little ridges where it has to go through exactly. That goes in there. And this is attached right here, and then you have to know a little bit about soldering. Attach that in there, and then basically when you put that in there, it's going to go all the way in, and then your cap is going to close, and you're going to have your little DC jack. Probably a little hole in here if you want, sticking out, and bam, there's your little extra mod for wall power. And basically I will be creating another vid soon. Please watch all these videos so you understand how the device works, the parts you need, 
It's very important. You don't skip in directly into the third, fourth, fifth, sixth, what, how many other videos I create. Thank you, guys. Uh, thanks for watching.